Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're at. Uh, welcome back, guys. Ben here with Swift English. So today we're going to take a look at an awesome word everybody should know. And you could encounter this word in so many you know, areas. And that's deprived. And it's actually an adjective. So uh, what does it mean? Lacking important things like food and water. Now, uh, it's not you know, strictly about food and water, but food and water are just examples of things that you could be uh, deprived of. And it could be other things as well. All right, so let's take a look. If we're sleep deprived, so you know, then we'll struggle with our daily tasks and responsibilities. So in this case, uh, if you're deprived of your sleep, that means you're not getting any sleep at all, okay? You're just missing that. And, you know, sleep obviously is a necessity. So it's something you need to do in order to survive. All right. So this amazing diet allows you to eat quantities of your favorite foods. So it's like a consequence. You won't feel deprived. So in this case, uh, deprived, you know, is related to food again. So uh, if this diet this meal plan allows you to eat some of your favorite food, you feel like you're not really missing them because they're part of your diet as well. All right. So let's take a look at this third example. Victims of war are deprived of food, water, and more. So food, water, maybe sanitation resources. It could be a lot of things, right? Shelter, right? A lot of things here. People are being deprived of their human rights. So sometimes it's not something that's necessarily concrete, like food, water, right, oxygen. But sometimes it could be something a little bit more deeper than the surface meaning. So human rights, dignity, right, um, these kinds of attributes could also uh, be connected to deprivation, right? So you could be missing these things as well. So, you know, just be familiar with this word. It could show up in so many different places like topics related to the environment or, you know, topics related to history, politics, sociology. It could be found any, anywhere, even psychology. So um, please smash the like button, share uh, this video with your friends, family, you know, classmates, colleagues, and subscribe to my channel if you already haven't. I'll see you guys in the future.